Hello, hello, hello. Good evening, good evening. Can you hear me? Good evening. Yes, teacher. Yes, I can. Okay, nice. Um, welcome. Let's see. We are 16, 14 participants right now. Let's see. My goodness. We are going to wait a few minutes, okay? Probably the rest of the people are uh, joining the the meeting. So let's start with general info. So today is the last day, right? So uh, that's nice, amazing because you are you are you know getting more experience, more knowledge, and everything. So you are about to be in the next course, right? The next uh, model. So uh, hopefully you complete all the exercise, all the platform activities and everything. No sé si habrá alguien que todavía le falte algo. Yo esperaría que no. Vimos el listado ayer, si no estoy mal, de los que estaban pendientes. Y pues creo que logramos solucionar, ¿verdad? Los que estaban ahí, que les faltaba un poco o el examen final más que todo. Okay, so espero que sí hayan logrado finalizar because they already um, review and check your uh, scores and everything, right, about the platform. So this, the other thing, it's about the, about the, um, the attendance. So yesterday I mentioned people that was, you know, um, waiting right for for something or, or where like um esperando llegar ahora right to reach the 80 percent with the attendance for today or yesterday right so hopefully uh hopefully you get the 80 percent right so voy a volver a revisar si hubiera alguien que, que le falte lo dudo verdad pero vamos a mirar nuevamente para que Esté seguro usted pues que llegó a su 80% y lo que usted haga de ahora este, va a aparecer hasta mañana. Entonces si llega un 70 y algo ahora pues con lo de mañana tendría que, con lo de ahora perdón, mañana tendría que aparecerle ya este, el 80. So, uh, it's the last day, so... Remember, this is something personal, right? So you need to do the process to be in the next course, to be in the next model. So you need to send the information that they request and all the details, okay? In order for you to be added into the new uh, class, into the new group, okay? So I don't know if you have any question or something about uh, the next uh, course or I don't know, dudas, preguntas. No questions? No, teacher. Okay, Bro. so thank you, Mr. Carlos Adolfo. So we are going to pass the attendance right now. I'm waiting for more people, but um, we have to continue, right? So we need to move on and move on and move on. So um, let me move on right here. Good evening, Mr. Efrain. I am here. Nice, thank you. Okay, so let me see right here the attendance. Todavía faltan varios, pero mi modo. Voy a tratar de revisar al final el la attendance. Deje ver aquí que esto no, no me carga. What are you talking about? Okay, so veamos acá. 
So like always, please uh, let me know, right? Let me know if you are done with this. Today is 18, right? Mm -hmm. Friday. So Anna Christine. Present teacher. Okay. Briseida Janet. Briseida, no? No ha venido, probably. So let's see, my goodness, what happened? So Carlos Adolfo, it's there. Present teacher. Nice. Yes. Claudia Jeseni. Present. Nice. Let's see. Now we have um, Daniela Mercedes. I'm here too. Nice. Emanuel Efraín. Emanuel, ahí está. Eh, Evelyn Janet. Present. Good evening. Good evening. Eh, Evelyn Janet. Present. Oh, okay. So then we have Flor de Maria. Flor de Maria, no. Freddy Alberto. Freddy Alberto, no. Glenda Lisette. Okay. Let's see, Glenda. Iliana Mariel. Iliana, no. Eh, Janessi Alexandra, por eso verla por ahí. Present. Nice. Uh, Jefferson Alexander. Jefferson, no. Jorge Mauricio. Present. Okay, Mauricio. Eh, Jocelyn Tatiana. Present, chair. Nice, Tatiana. Juan Jose. I'm here, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome, Luis Miguel. Luis, me pareció ver que estaba ahí conectado. Eh, Rachel Esther. Present, teacher. Nice. Rebeca Paola. Rebeca Paola, no. Ronald Rafael. Present teacher. Nice, Ronald. Roxana Marisol. Present teacher. Nice. Eh, Sandra Noemi. Present teacher. Nice. Eh, Sara Verónica. Bien, deje ver si cambió acá el porcentaje. Y sí. Amazing Jefferson, Alexander, es que está bajito. Y Rachel Esther. Bien. So, estoy revisando el, el, el score que tienen. Definitivamente, ya la mayoría está ya en color verde, es decir, arriba del 80. Good job. Congratulations, because you will be in the next, right, in the next course. So, uh, let's see. We are going to see the last part that we have, okay, that is uh, present continuous. So, we already um, know what is the present continuous, right? So, who can tell me uh, details about present continuous when we are going to use uh, present continuous. Ajá. ¿De qué se acuerdan? Eso ya lo vimos en módulos anteriores. Eh, son eventos de, de, del futuro que se van a dar o se están dando. Mm. 
Hmm. Future. Mm -hmm. What else? Future, what else? Uh, uh -huh. Are you thinking be? Um, no, 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 no. I uh, remember the present continuous um, action. Um, can be I, I make or I feel, for example, if, for example, if mm -hmm. any people question me, what do you do? Ah, I'm working because I work in this moment. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I, I think I get your point. Okay, so nice, Carlos Adolfo, you're right, okay? But we need to be more specific, okay? More okay. clear. Mm -hmm. Let's see, teacher, uh -huh. what else? Teacher, mm -hmm. lo que yo Listen. recuerdo es que se agrega ING para ser presente continuo. Ah, very good, that is a nice detail, right? So uh the the present continuous is the famous ing form right so normally we say the the ing form right the present continuous so this is also related with the gerums okay probably you see it before okay el gerundio dice uno in, in spanish right so but in this case in this case the present continuous so it's a tense, right? We have the verb to be, we have the simple present, we have the simple past, and also we have the present continuous. So the present continuous is the famous ING, okay? Presente progresivo, okay? So that's the way we call it, presente progresivo, okay? So uh, when we are going to use the present continuous, okay? Present continuous, okay? Those, that is for uh, progressive actions, okay? So that is something that it's not ending, okay? Um, it's something that um, we are doing the action at the moment that we are talking, right? For example, uh, you can, you can, um, for example, you can say, I'm, um, having a class right now okay i'm working right now okay usted me puede decir eh, i'm drinking uh, beer right now where my goodness emmanuel my god today Beers. is friday teacher <laughs> and that is true ahí allá al fondo se le ve la botella cabal emmanuel efraín ¿no? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> eh, pierna, dice, and the body knows. Yes. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Ex exacto. Right. So, present continuous. One more time. So, veamos. Vamos a definir. Present continuous is a grammar tense, right? Like the simple past, the uh, simple present. So, this is present continuous, right? So, this is for progressive or in activities that you are doing at the moment that you are talking, right? For example, I can say, I'm uh, teaching English. Um, uh, I'm teaching English right now. So, um, so that's what I'm doing, right? Si usted estuviera, por ejemplo, comiendo ahorita, okay? Um, usted me diría, I'm eating right now. Okay, estoy comiendo. So that is present continuous, but it's not the only, uh, that is not the only uh, situation, right? So ese es uno de, de los más comunes, okay? Que yo voy a decir que estoy eh, haciendo la acción. Está en el momento que yo um, estoy hablando, right? So I'm eating, okay? I'm working right now. Si usted me dice, mire, yo ahorita estoy trabajando, right? So I'm working, okay? So uh, that is an action that it's not, you know, uh, it's not ending, okay? Usted está hablando en el momento que está haciendo la acción, right? So that is the easy one, okay? Lo que usted debe de tener aquí presente es eso, right? There are some exceptions, right? That's not the only one, but 
At least keep in mind that present continuous is this terms in which you are doing the action at the moment that you are speaking. Usted me dice, mire, aquí voy caminando en español. Mire, aquí voy caminando en la calle. So I'm walking right now, okay? So the expressions that we are going to use for the present continuous is at this moment, right now, now, okay? So um, let's see, uh, Juan Jose, I guess you have a question. I'm cooking dinner. I'm cooking the dinner. Se podría. Yes, I'm cooking dinner right now. Okay, usted ahorita oh, yeah. está cocinando su cena, right? Haciendo su oh, cena. Yeah, yeah. So, uh -huh. yeah, that can be. Okay, so it says right here that uh, this describes something which is happening at the exact moment of the speech. Okay, lo que acabo de mencionar. La situación, la acción está sucediendo al momento eh, que, que yo estoy hablando, right? So, okay. also it says that it's an, a situation that describes an action that it's taking place now, okay? So, it's almost the same. Um, it's also, um, we are going to use present continuous also for something in the future, but that you know that it happened, right? Como que yo estoy como un poco seguro um, de que va a suceder. Por ejemplo, usted me dice, mire, fíjese que yo estoy estudiando, no sé, japonés, right? Lo que sea. So, that is something in the future, porque ahorita tal vez no está estudiando, ahorita, pero usted está en un curso que se está dando en un periodo de tiempo. So, that is present continuous. Usted me puede decir, I'm taking Japanese classes, okay? Right now in my life. So, no es que solo va a ir a una clase, sino que tal vez es un módulo de qué, seis meses, qué sé yo. So, the action is at the moment, right? No ha terminado. Inició en el pasado, pero continúa en el presente, porque usted tal vez, no sé, pueda que empezó sus clases de lo que sea, natación, lo que sea, no sé, en enero, febrero, marzo. So, it's in the past, right? Pero como no han terminado, sino que usted sigue en esa actividad, so present continuous, right? So you are doing the action seems the past, but it's not end, okay? So todavía usted está en clase y todavía le va a faltar para el futuro, okay? Uh, also, we can describe uh, temporary situations. For example, I'm staying with a friend for a few days, okay? So es una situación temporal pero que está pasando ok que usted no sabe exactamente cuándo termine pero sabe que es algo temporal ok no es que usted este va a estar así siempre ok es una situación temporal uh, it's also says to describe uh, changing situations for example her health it's improving by lips and bones okay so that is something that is um getting better right cuando alguien está enfermo o sea usted no se enferma como un segundo y ya después ya no sino que usted empieza con algo está el malestar ahí pero usted sabe que 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 se va a recuperar o que va a pasar o que va a terminar ese, ese proceso so that is um changing situations right so you are already drinking bills or whatever so the situation will be better so i don't know if we are clear on this questions no questions okay so let's see the the examples that we have right here so daniela mercedes Help us with the three uh, first questions and answer. And remember, even though this is present continuous, uh, we have the two options, right? We can use present continuous with the verb be, and also we can use present continuous with WH questions. So right now, just the verb be uh, questions with the present continuous and the answers, please. Okay, teacher. Um... Are you living at home now? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is your sister working for the government? Yes, she is. No, she's not. Or no, she isn't. Are Ed and you going to college this year? Yes, they are. No, they're not. Or no, they aren't. 
Oh, nice. Thank you. I'm already share with you the formula, right? The grammar terms and also the, the forms, right? Remember that like in Spanish, right? And also the other um, the other tenses, right? So we can create positive sentence, negative sentence. We can create questions and also the answers, right? So in this case, the first three questions are present continuous with the verb be. Are you living at home now? Yes, I am or no, I am not. Remember they are the uh, yes, no questions, right? Siempre que empiezan con el verbo to be, hemos mencionado que de est estas son yes, no questions. O sea, que la respuesta que yo espero es un sí o un no. ¿Verdad? No se va a ir usted eh, eh, a, otro, a otra opción. Ok, so it's simple la like that. Ok, so uh, let's see the next uh, three. Uh, Carlos Adolfo, help us with the three. WH questions with the uh, verb present continuous. Okay, Miss. Mm -hmm. um, where are you working now? I'm not working. I need a job. What is your brother going this day? He's traveling in the Amazon. How are your parents visit this weekend? They are missing my grandmother, my grandmother. Okay, thank you, Mr. So, WH, right? Where are you working now? What is your brother doing these days? Who are your parents visiting this week, right? So, these ones are WH, right? So, ya sabemos cuáles son las WH questions. And in this case, they are combined with the verb uh, with the present continuous, okay? So, el verbo to be en base también acá, right? Porque usted ya sabe cuál es el uh, sujeto, right? Am is are para el, el verbo que le están eh, mencionando. So, and uh, with the WH questions, um, you know that um, the answer will be complete, right? So, la like, yes, no question, dijimos que yo solo digo si no, it's está bien, right? Yes, I am, no, no. But in this case, WH, so they are information, right? Usted no puede decir solo sí, no. Okay, look at the example. Where are you working? I'm not working. I need a job. So that, that will be the present continuous. So let's see if we can complete this, okay? It says exercise eight, complete these conversations using the present continuous, okay? So we need to look at the picture, okay? And let's see if we are able to analyze and complete the, the, the conversation. Also, um, you have the verb in parentheses, okay? So let's see. Um, Efraín Emanuel. So number one, letter eight. And uh, Juan Jose, letter B. Okay, number one, letter B. So go ahead. Ahí hay que tratar de completar. Hola, hola, Efraín. Sorry, I'm sorry. Hey, hi, Stephanie. What do you do? Hey, Mark. I studying in a elevator, elevator, and it's stuck. Oh no! Are you okay? Yeah, I wipe it moving now. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Okay. So, hi, Stephanie. What are you doing? Right? So, that is a typical question, right? ING. What are you doing? Hey, Mark. I'm standing in an elevator and it's stuck. Okay. So, prácticamente atorado, ¿verdad? Está atorado mm -hmm. en, el, en el elevador. Y le dice él, uh, oh, no. Are you okay? Yes. I am waiting uh, now, okay? So, no, aquí le dice, are you okay? Yeah, I wait. O sea, I que wait. como que en, el, que, que en que? el momento, ¿verdad? Lo llegaron a arreglar. So, um, yeah, I'm um, waiting. So, it's, verbo to be, right? It is or it's 
moving now, ok, now. como que se está moviendo ya ahorita, ya no está atrapado. So, let's see the next one, number two. So, let's see. Uh, Rachel Esther, you are uh, number two, letter eight. And... Okay. No hay cámara, oh, Dios mío. So, Ana Cristina. So B, letter B, please. Okay. Are your brother spending oh, yeah. a lot of money? Okay, you are letter A, right? So, Marcy. Ah, Mar uh -huh. Mercy, how... Are you and Justin enjoying your shopping trip? Este? B. We having a lot of fun. Uh, is your brother spending uh, a lot of money? Okay, it's just letter B, okay, Chris, it's solo letter B. Continue ahí, ya le, le dio ahí la respuesta. Uh -huh. Continue. Uh... En la siguiente, la B. No more. He buying only one or two things. That's all. That's all, okay. So, Mercy, how are you, um, how are you enjoying um, you and Justin, your shopping treat. Okay, le dice, we are having a lot of fun. Y le dice, luego, spend. Okay. Eh, ¿Cómo sería ahí? La, la respuesta le dice, no, mom, he is buying only one or two things. That's all. Okay. So what are Hola. you... Yo le he comprado un par de cosas. Uh -huh. ¿Cuál sería? Aquí sería una doble H question, right? Uh -huh. Which one? He is buying. It's your brother buying a lot of, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, it's your brother spending a lot of money. Okay. No, mom, it's... Um, he is buying only one or two things, okay? So that will be, right? So it's your brother spending a lot of money, okay? Remember the INGs, okay? So ING, it's not the, uh, it's not just the, the teams, right? So the thing is that, um, deje ver aquí en el chat, okay? So, um, you need to, convert the verb, right? Hay que pasar prácticamente el verbo a la forma del ING, okay? So, uh, you have the formula, right? Ahí el grupo le mandé la formula, okay? So, this is the last part, but we are going to uh, keep it right here into the quantifiers, okay? These ones are related with the uh, present continuous, okay? So, because these ones are, as it says in English, quantifiers. So, how we call them in Spanish? ¿Cómo decimos estos en español? Nadie. I coming from. Okay, so los cuantificadores, o sea que usted da como una medida, ¿verdad? Usted da como un porcentaje. Como un aproximado. Exacto. Ok. So, ajá. Uh -huh. So, this one's are the quantifier. Let's see. Ok. So, it says right here, all, nearly, all, must, many, a lot of, some, not many, a few, few, and no one. Ok. So, did you remember the adverse of frequency? Espero que sí se acuerden. Ahí hay una tablita de frecuencia, right? Del, from zero to a hundred, okay? So no one gets married before the age of 18. Um, a few couples 
have more than one child. Okay, so many families, okay, or a lot of families are smaller these days, okay? So esto solamente son expresiones que yo voy a utilizar para dar énfasis o dar un, un aproximado, right? Un porcentaje de X cosa dependiendo de lo que sea el tema, right? So uh, these part quantifiers, we are not gonna stop that much on this. And uh, we are going to see the last part. So this is the last one, okay? But we have time, okay? We have time for something different, okay? So ahí en el grupo de WhatsApp creo que le compartí la, la fórmula, okay? So la fórmula de eh, el present continuous, okay? With the present continuous, you can uh, mix the quantifiers, right? So ahí es donde usted puede unirlos, aplicar, okay? So we are going to do something different, okay? So because of the time and we need to. <clears throat> so let me open the rooms, okay? Small groups, we are going to create three groups only, okay? So what we are going to do in the groups, okay? We are going to create, we are going to write uh, sentences, okay? in present continuous, okay? So you're going to write five positive sentence using present continuous, can be any subject. And then you are going to convert or transfer those positive sentence into negative, right? So using the present continuous, but now uh, negative. And then the same five, um, the same fine, uh, negative sentences, you are going to transfer those sentences into questions, okay? So, la voy a hacer pregunta. Puede ser una yes, no question, or it can be a WH questions, okay? But remember, the tense and the verb must be in ING form, okay? So, five, five, and five. Prácticamente son 15 oraciones, right? La misma pueden utilizar. Por ejemplo, usted me dice, eh, I am cooking right now, okay? So, it's okay. Then uh, you say, um, I am not cooking right now, okay? And it's okay. And then uh, you can say, I'm, I'm cooking right now. So, that is a question. So, creo que ya hemos hecho un ejercicio similar o parecido a, parecido a, a, a ese, ¿ok? So, no sé si está claro. Uh, Va a crear cinco es que... oraciones positivas, cinco negativas y cinco preguntas. La misma la puede convertir. Usted me dice, I am studying English right now. I am not studying English right now, and I'm studying English right now. Ahí está. Okay. So, are we clear? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> let, let me open the rooms, okay? I will give you five minutes. Quiere decir que en cinco minutos tiene un minuto para escribir la, la positiva, la negativa y la pregunta. Cinco en total.
Okay, so welcome back. So no sé si terminaron en el grupo que estuvo al final, pues sí, lograron finalizar. Okay, so uh, my goodness, time is running so fast. Look at the time. So um, this is the last day, right? So today is the last uh, class and with the present continuous, we finish, okay? So if you realize and if you see, uh, this course is like a recap, right? Did you remember the word recap? Recapitular. Uh -huh. What else? ¿Qué dijimos que era recap? Uh -huh. Un repaso, right? Un review. Ese es un recap, un review, un repaso, right? So, si usted analiza todo este módulo, pues ha sido prácticamente eso, right? Un review de topics that you already know, right? So, we mentioned uh, the verb be, we mentioned the simple present, a few details about the, the, the past, okay? And now that we are talking about the present continuous. If you have questions, if you have doubts, please uh, let me know now, right? Because we need to make sure that we are clear, okay? So present continuous is the ING. So let's see, uh, Freddy Alberto, read one of your uh, positive, right? Positive sentence, okay? The one that you have. Only one or Everybody. Yeah. Uh, just Freddy, just one now, one ah, positive. Okay. Mm -hmm. I am reading a book now. I am reading a book ah, reading now. A book now. Okay, mm -hmm. I am reading a book now. So nice. Now uh, let's see, Jocelyn Tatiana, convert or transfer that positive into negative. La misma que mencionó Fred. I am, I am not reading book. Now. Okay, I am not reading a book now. Now the question, Emmanuel. Emmanuel Efraín. Are you reading right now? Okay, are you reading right now? Are you reading a book right now? Okay, nice. So if you see, that is the way, right? So yo sé que Todos escribieron y yo creería que no tenemos muchos problemas con el presente continuo, right? Remember that this is a terms that we are going to use just in case if you are having something, right? Acuérdese que es como something that is starting in the past, but it still is affecting the uh, present, right? So ahí yo puedo usar el presente continuo, okay? So questions about present continuous? No, really, right? No, so, really. Um, we have almost uh, 10 more minutes, okay? So, and I don't know if you would like to have like a, a picture about your classmates and everything, okay? No sé. <coughs> La respectiva foto para que le crean que ha estado desvelándose en clase. <laughs> si no, no le van a creer. Hey, está Mauricio, yeah, ready for the picture. So you are in a ready. computer. Uh -huh. You are in a computer, eh. Mauricio. Alguien que pueda, I guess, or Freddy, I don't know, probably you are on a computer. So I don't know if you are able to take a screenshot, okay? Si puede tomar una captura de pantalla desde una computadora, sería lo ideal. Eh, ya regreso, toca la puerta, perdón. Okay. Uh. Freddy Alberto, you. Eh, esperamos ayer. Eh, sí, ayer. esperemos. Solo en el, todo eso, por favor, vamos activando cámara. ¿Verdad? Uh -huh. Déjese ver. Ahí está Rachel Esther. Ahí vino ya este Juan José. Ahí está Roxana Marisol. <risa> y a Nancy todo. también. Ok. So, Sandra Noemí. Algunos que hasta ahora los estoy conociendo. Ahí mandé una foto de, de prueba al, al grupal. Ya, you already took the picture, my goodness. No, so, no avisaste That otra. was so fast. Sí. Ajá, no, so. es prueba, por eso le puse ah, test. Ah, ok, test, ok, es un test, okay, so test picture. Uh, 
Yeah, because you need to tell us, okay? Tiene que avisar ahí. Okay, so remember, uh, yeah, today is, is the last day, right? So it is nice if you uh, keep in mind these classes and everything. And of course, you need to continue, right? So you need to continue with the classes, the next uh, course. I guess you are already um, done with your paper uh, documents and everything that you need to send, right? They request that info, okay, in advance in order for you to have the time, enough time for you to send that information and, and, and be, right? Continue with the, with the classes. Remember, that is the important thing, right? So be engaged, be with the uh, course and do not give up, right? So that will be my best advice, my best recommendation. It's uh, do not forget that you are learning, okay? So little by little, you are learning something, okay? Probably you will think, ah, pero mucho me cuesta, okay? So I understand and it's, it's okay because it's not easy, okay? It's not easy when we are learning because we have doubts or we feel that it's impossible, but of course you will get it, okay? So my best advice is, uh, continue with the course, okay? Continue with the process um, and, and do your best, definitely, right? English is uh, something that we can use in many areas, right? So that's why you are, um, you are learning in these classes, right? It's not easy, okay? Believe me that it's not, okay? Because it's late, because sometimes we are so like kind of tired, okay? But it's something that you will see that at the end, so you will learn, okay? So, así le, le digo, yo lo animo, yo lo motivo a que usted continúe, okay? Con las clases, con el módulo, no se desanime. Que me cuesta, creo yo que a todo, ¿verdad? Nos cuesta un poco alguna cuestión de, en respecto al idioma, pero, pero aquí estamos, Dice, right? Dice, okay? eh, con... Lo que usted estaba diciendo ahorita, ayer leí algo sobre que dice eh, que la disciplina vencerá a la inteligencia. Y creo de que eh, si tenemos disciplina en lo que estamos haciendo y aprendiendo, pues vamos a ver resultados más adelante. Sí, definitivamente. Mire, o sea. Y ese, ese dicho es un, es un japonés, no me recuerdo cómo se llama, pero él dijo eso. De que la inteligencia, no, perdón, que la disciplina vencerá la inteligencia. Yeah, because if you are constantly, constantly doing something, at the end you will get it, right? So, pero si usted dice, ay, es que está muy difícil, mejor me voy, mejor me retiro. So, queda perdido el desvelo que ha acumulado hasta el día de hoy. Ya no lo va a recuperar. Ok, so, así okay. es. Algunos, ¿verdad? Personas a las ocho ya están dormidas, como un animalito, un pollito, right? But in this case, in your situation, so you are um, taking part of your time that I think and I guess is not that much, right? Por el poquito tiempo que usted tiene. So you try to invest, right? In, in something that you will see good in the future, right? So... That will be my best recommendation. Do not give up, give up, but sorry. Continue with the classes, continue with the sections, okay? And do your part, okay? Analyze este módulo. Usted diga, quiero ver qué tan buen alumno ha sido este módulo. Qué me falta mejorar, qué es lo que eh, no he completado, qué es lo que yo considero que me cuesta. So you can analyze, right? So you can analyze yourself. And um, as I told you, no se rinda, no tire a la basura lo que ha logrado, lo que ha hecho. O sea, estamos en intermedio, ¿ok? So, algo ha avanzado, algo ha avanzado, ¿ok? But you need to continue. So, uh, we have kind of five more minutes and we need the picture, ¿ok? So, ahora sí. Vamos a la fotografía oficial, la foto de recuerdo. Usted la, la, vamos, la vamos a mandar ahí al grupo. Usted la quiere conservar, guárdela. Si usted no la quiere, pues no la descargue. Pero eh, la idea es tener ese, ese detalle, ¿verdad? Ese recuerdo de, 
cuando estuve aquí en sufrimiento en las clases, <risa> right? En de velo. <risa> La tortura, la tortura, no son la bromas. La tortura, Dios mío. El de pelo, el de pelo. Bueno, voy a hacer una prueba ahorita, no sé quién más va también a tomar, pero voy a hacer una prueba ahorita. La mando Bye. y ahí voy Enciendan a hacer... la cámara, por favor. Y ahí me dicen, con esta estamos y ahí. Bye. Voy Bye. en una, dos y tres. La voy a mandar acá. Solo que la voy a recortar un segundo. Ya le envío. Are you the, the Va, best ten, vean ten ahí novel. la tecnología ahí. Con filtro sin filtro la puse. No, sí. 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 <risa> sin filtro. Vaya, pues nos va a ir. ¿Me parece? No nos vaya a salir como con ojos azules nosotros aquí. Voy a, a capturar otra y la mando. Voy aquí. Avísame que no aguanto la respiración. Dale, 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 ya, ya. <risa> bueno. Tan exagerado. <risa> para que no le salga estómago, dice. Para que salga Pachito, está conteniéndolo. Principotón, quiero ver aquí de este lado. Ah, está bien. Vean, es. Nos está dando gusto. Ah, eso está bien. Creo que salimos todos los que estamos con cámara. También se puede descargar ahí el chat. Uh -huh. Acuérdense. Okay. Este. Aquí han mandado bueno. también se puede descargar el chat. Ah, es que aquí han mandado aquí al chat. ¿eh? Ah. Freddy. Ah, sí, esa ya la descargué, una que enviaste. No sé uh -huh. si hay otra. Aquí. Ahí mandaron otra, ahí la mandó Carlos. Hay algo, algo so, a, a, al gusto, para que usted escoja el su perfil sí. mejor ahí. <ríe> Donde quedó Pero, mejor. Ok, so eh, I have three minutes y no lo voy a dejar ir sin pasar el attendance porque varios no, no habían ingresado, ok, no habían ingresado eh, al momento que pasé, solamente déjeme ver eso, quiero ver, permítame, confírmeme asistencia, Briseida Janet. Briseida Janet, ¿no está? Uh, Flor de María. Flor de María. Freddy Alberto. I'm here. Freddy Alberto. Me conecté 10 uh -huh. a las 8, pero me desconecté otra vez. Ok, ok. Iliana Mariel. Iliana Mariel. Jefferson Alexander. Jefferson, Rebeca Paola y Sara Verónica. So, ahí estamos. Los que no. Oops. So, los que no mencioné porque ya tenían su asistencia desde el inicio. Ok. So, um, no vaya a llorar. So, because you are going to continue, right? So, I don't yes. know if, you, if I will be with you next course. I, I hope so. I would like to. But that is something that is not on my hands, right? So yo no decido eh, qué grupo me gusta o con quién quiero estar, ¿ok? Solamente nos asignan y ahí, pues, de manera aleatoria, pues, ellos saben cómo hacen sus movimientos. But anyway, right? So in case if I will be with you next course, so I will be nice because we can continue, right? But if not, so even though, I'm now as a teacher with you, so you are going to continue, right? So you are going to be learning. So one more minute. Alguien que quiera decir algo, opinar algo. No vaya a hacer llorar a la gente. <risa> bueno, quizás agradecerles a todos porque cuando hemos hecho los, los grupos pequeños, pues todos hemos sido muy activos, muy participativos. Eh, 
Y a usted, teacher, la paciencia y todo el esmero que le pone a cada clase para nosotros, eh, eh, creo que hablo por todos, es muy okay. valioso porque eh, todos tenemos una curva de aprendizaje, tal vez unos más lentos, otros son más rápidos para agarrar la idea, pero usted nos, nos ayuda a todos, así que creo que hablo por todo el equipo, muchas gracias. Muchas gracias por todo. Okay, thank you, Mr. Carlos Adolfo. It's nice. I guess this is the second or third, como tres módulos creo que lleva usted, verdad, que hemos estado compartiendo. Dos con y... este, porque usted ah, okay. me dio el, el principiante uno. Ah, the very beginning. Okay, <laughs> nice. I would so... like to teaching again, teacher. I'm sorry, Efraín. I would like teaching again. Okay, you would like that I can be teaching one more time with this group, right? So I hope so, right? I hope so. Más adelante nos podemos encontrar nuevamente, no, no lo dudo, okay? So, but as I told you, Efraín, that's not on my hands, right? So no, no, yo no puedo decir, es que yo quiero aquí grupo, right? So ellos ya le, le asignan a uno y, y ya, pues. Pero it's a pleasure, right? So please continue. Mire lo del teléfono en inglés. Hágalo de verdad, no por, porque yo le estoy diciendo, porque yo quiera, es porque lo necesita. Ok, okay. lo necesita y usted necesita mentalizarse que tiene que vivir, dormir, comer, llorar, cantar, todo en inglés. ¿Verdad? O sea, tiene que hacerlo, si no nunca vamos a, a, a progresar. Las clases le van a ayudar, pero si usted pone eso de su parte... O sea, el progreso usted lo va a ver quizás a un plazo menor. Ok. So, appreciate your time and everything. Ok. So, thank you for your time. Carlos, also thank you for the pictures que ahí las mandó. Ok. Um, you have my number in case if you need something. So, you can uh, text me. You can call me. No, I pedir dinero, right? So, just if you need something about... Um, Something about the language, right? Something about English. I will be there for you to help you out, right? Okay. So thank you, everyone. And I hope to see you soon. Okay. Um, please. Bye-bye. Take care. And see you soon, right? So not tomorrow because we don't have class tomorrow. But see you soon, right? Probably allá en el avanzado nos volvemos a ver. Okay. So bye-bye. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you very much, teacher, for all. Bye. 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 Thank you, teacher. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye. Thank you. For Thank all. you. Bye bye. Good Take bye, care. Everyone. I send a uh, Hugh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank bye. you, Freddy. Appreciate it. Bye. <laughs> okay. Have a nice, a good night. <laughs> good night. Okay. The same for you, um, Freddy. Bye bye. Okay, bye-bye.